Hey guys, Bruno here. Welcome back to Medieval Engineers episode number four. Here you can see our new workshop, which I did build off camera. So I've done a few things that you guys may not have seen. So the sun is starting to rise. Let's head on in and check out the new workshop. So come on in through our main door. So you come into this little area, which is a semi storage slash workshop slash like smithy area. Um, this is something to start with now before we build our proper blacksmiths. Ooh, bit of lag there at the moment. Got our swords, swords stored up here out of the way. Come up the stairs, which sometimes we do get stuck. We've got um, our new oven here, our little wheel there to make our, our wool and all that sort of stuff. We make our linen string and the cloth and ropes and stuff. And then we've got our mill here as well. Just a little barrel storage area here for food and berries and whatever else we decide to put in there. But there's not a lot up here at the moment. You can see that comes through the roof, unfortunately. Our little chimney stack outside. Have to duck to get down through here. If it's going to let us. There we go. And then we come downstairs into the basement. We've got a duck to get down there as well. You see down here we've got um, two of these clay ovens here. And then here we've got two furnaces and a storage area here, which has just got clay jars in there at the moment. And I've got a little trap door, which is hard to get in and out of, but sort of off the side of the house. And then we've just got a little workshop, a couple of barrels and stuff stored outside here. So it's just something I've sort of just googled um, and got the picture of and thought mm, that looks pretty cool as a workshop. So I designed it and I decided to put a little basement in as well. Now here I've got the beginnings of our farm. So I've put some stone surrounding. Um, and then I'm going to have to fill it up. We've got the pegs here which allows us to make sure we chuck dirt in here. But it doesn't actually go over this level so we can go through and make this 100% level and now we're going to try and automate the farming at some stage it's going to take a lot of time to get it flat and level though so and now this is just our little little humble abode I guess you, you would say so it's just our bed a little bit of storage stuff which is where all our food is for now when we get hungry and our our cupboard and stuff and still got all our wood and stones down here so this episode, I want to get advanced mechanics um, started. So we'll go down here and grab some stuff. We need to grab some stone. 52 timbers. I think that's probably more than enough. Uh, nine round ones. We've got three. Okay, let's grab a couple of these. Um, oops. Don't want that. Bugger. I forgot that I was cutting down trees and just crafting sticks last ep before um, I finished that last episode. Um, more timbers, 16 wheat straws, one millstone, six clay jars of linseed oil. I need to obtain four cloth as well. Uh, one. two, three, and four. Um, where did we put our jars? I did see them somewhere. They were downstairs, weren't they? So grab those. Now, a jar with linseed oil. We don't do it in there, no. Not sure exactly where we make the jars of linseed oil. Assuming it's upstairs here somewhere. I hope we need a millstone as well. So. Ah, there we go. So we need flax seeds and six jars. Okay. I don't know if we're going to have enough. Go downstairs and work out where I'll put everything now. 
I did move the stuff around and I can't remember where I put everything. There should be nothing in these barrels, I don't think. No. Hmm. I can't remember where I put everything now. Could be back in the house, I think. All our seeds. Not there, not there. Wow, where did we put them? Oop, we don't want to do that. I'm sure they should be around somewhere. I don't think I put them outside in any of these containers. No, where did all our seeds and stuff go? They're not in there, they're not in this one. Not there either, and they're not in my inventory. I'm not sure where they are, to be honest. So there's nothing in these. I'm not in there, and I can't find where I put the wheat and um, all that other stuff. Okay, anyway, let's grab. We need to make a millstone. We need five timbers and five stone. Oh, got that back. Uh, 16 wheat straws. Four windmill blades. Are they in here? Oh, here they are. We need those, those. That might be enough, I think. We still don't have the linseed oil, unfortunately. Hopefully you guys can't hear that. We've got a little bit of thunder going on outside at the moment at my house, so... We need this flax. Luckily our cabbage is good to go. Some of it is anyway. Some of this hasn't grown yet. Do with some more wheat and some more cabbage. I just don't know where I put everything, to be honest. Um, the next thing I was going to do was build our um, little workshop, well not workshop, a sawmill. So I do have an idea for it. It's just a matter of hopefully getting it to work. That's the main thing. So I'm going to come in here and grab as much of this stuff as we can. The majority of these walls they take sticks and planks and all that sort of stuff. So let's go and grab some more sticks and I'm going to get started on the building. Hopefully that stuff will be ready soon. Cabbages are ready now so Grab all these sticks, grab all the planks, I don't know if I'll need them all, but this dead set got me beat where I put the snow, or else I could have put um, our flax and all that sort of stuff, so yeah, I'm not sure exactly where everything's gone, so I'm thinking here somewhere will be where we start, so I want to just bring this down so it's like a plowed area so we don't have any grass coming through the floor be a good start. So the main part of the building is going to be um, 3 by 3 So we'll grab that, that, that for now. I don't want it like that. I want it I sort of want it on the ground, but I didn't want it that direction. Mm, it's going to be hard to get it the way I want it to go, I think. I think about here is probably as good as it's going to get. There it will do, I think. So it's going to be off the ground a little bit.
So it's going to be the main main area. Just whack all this together. Hopefully you guys do actually want to see me building something instead of just um, building like I did before and you guys not seeing anything. Uh, I won't be able to jump up on there, I don't think. Nah. Grab a set of stairs. Turn it that way, there we go. So this is going to be where our windmill starts. I'm going to have the windmill go up and like out that way then I'm going to have the building the offset sort of building on this side I think I'm going to do it say 4 by 3 probably should have ploughed the ground a little bit but oh well We want to plough the soil, not start whacking the ground, the, the flooring and stuff. There we go. Come down here as well. There we go. Jump up and knock all these in. I think we could probably make it one more long, I think. So let's knock the soil down again. Can't make it because we've got no wooden sticks. This is the reason why I was transferring all these logs down here into sticks. So I just kept running out. Grab them all and let's just make that many. That'll do for now. So one, two, three, four, we'll make it one more long. There you go. Go up and knock all these in. I do have a rough idea of how I want it to look, so it's just a matter of um, making it look right. We're going to be short on timbers too already. I'm going to have to go and grab some more. Okay, number nine is our stairs, and I want them to be just here. Got no timbers, of course. Down and grab all the timbers I've got in here now. Luckily, we've got times 10 inventory, so pretty much take anything we need. And not have to worry about size or anything. There you go, finish these couple off. Put in a window here. Actually, we need to put flooring in first, don't we? That might be a good idea. For some reason, we've got to click it twice every time. Still need more planks. Okay. Need to build heaps more planks. It takes a fair while though, there we go. Shouldn't be taking this long, but a bit of a pain. So every time we click on it, it actually takes two. So we'll 
at our farm. Our farm's still growing, but not quick enough. I wonder if we can get it like that. There we go. So we're not putting extra down that we don't need. Get out of the way. Ugh. There we go. Put that one there as well. Knock this one in first. Let's see if we can... Uh, wooden wall with shutters, why not? Short planks is for that as well. It take a while, I need a lot of planks to do what I want to do, so I might have to cancel that. We've got plenty of sticks at the moment, so I might run down and grab all of these logs out. It's going to let me, there we go. Take them up and turn them all into timbers. I'm not going to need any logs at the moment, so... Um, go here first. Oops. Timbers. Let's get it started, then we'll come back. That's done, that's done. Now, I just want to do get rid of that normal walls here. Which I don't know if it's going to let us do it up on top here. There we go. Ah, uh, where's the door there? another window in here. Oops. Some more walls in there. 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 We'll do a door without well, a doorway I should say. Get all these knocked in. Still need more planks. Tastes quicker with a steel um, hammer. Doesn't take anywhere near as long to make things. There we go, so that's part of it, and then I'm gonna do along there. And that's gonna that whole side's gonna be open there. Let's run back and see how many timbers I've got now. We should be finished. Get rid of that. We need like another workbench. It'd be perfect if we get another one. So not enough, not enough stuff here to help us do it quick. Another one right there, that'll do. So fill that up, and then we want to grab as many planks as we can. Shouldn't take too long. We've got no planks left there either. So get rid of that. So my idea now is to completely cover this building. We can turn it, there we go, in planks so it's like a, it's going to look much different than any other normal building. So like that and then like this one as well. 
So that'll be covered in planks the whole way around this whole building. So we're going to need tons and tons of them to get it to where I want it to be. Heaps more timbers. Let's put all of these in again. Tons of timbers and tons of sticks now, but still got a long way to go. There's not really much I can do until I can uh, work out what we're going to need to make um, the part of the windmill. I don't have enough planks, so what we're going to have to do is like obviously build something here so we can walk up and around the windmill because it's going to be probably four or five stories high. Grab all of them. Um, how many more? I don't know how many more we're going to need. Heaps. Let's go back now and see how much more of the floor we can do. Probably not going to finish it still. Go close, gotta be short by 20 or 30, I think. Need some planks for there as well. Do we need more for there as well? No, that's fine, that's all done. Grab some more there, that's finished. We've got any more? We do, we've got a few logs. I thought we had more planks than that. Obviously not. It's a backwards and forwards thing at the moment. I need to find um, right about 10 flax. So that's all we've got there, timbers. That's all we've got left. I can possibly... If I can't get... I can only so much I can get done before I'm going to have to pause the video and come back, I think. So... Also, what I want to do here is build a roof off to the side, so we're going to need some support. We'll get rid of this. Um, where are we? So, timbers. So that's going to be 10 there. And 9. We're going to come out... 10, which I think that's 10 as well, isn't it? Yeah, so get this one to come down. Another 10. Another 10, and then on there as well. and get it to stand up. So hopefully that'll be able to hold a roof that we're going to put on the end here. So let's go sideways. I think that should be enough if we do a 9 here and then another 10. Sure, no, so gonna, it's going to have to come off here somewhere. So, we might need to. Where did that one go? That one was on the ground, okay. So, maybe there. Get up here, put one of these on top. That gets a right height, and then from here out. And nine, so that's right, I think. 
Yeah, that's right. Nine, and then let's go from here down. To there, then you go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So nine there, nine there, nine there as well. Knock this out of the way. Oops. Knock all this out. So it's sort of going to be like a little storage area down here. Once we're finished making the, the sawmill. Uh, grab this, let's make a path over to the entrance or to the main door of the sawmill. There you go, I think that'll be pretty good there. So the roof's going to come off the top of this, hopefully. Uh, if we can find where it is. Going to do a wooden rooftop as well. So number eight. Not sure if it's going to let us do it or not. We need to try and get back up top. So let's grab that. Oh, get that out of the way. Grab a set of stairs so we can climb up onto here. Actually, I'm not sure if it's going to allow us to do it there because... There we go. If we put that there... There... Uh, on there as well. It's going to be tough whether it's going to let us do it along here because it's not actually the same side. So, it's just going to be like it's not touching anything because there's no wall along here. So, we might need to put in a wall here and then another wall there to the left once we get rid of those um, stairs but the doorway here as well not sort of gonna be like a double but it's the only way it's gonna be able to hold the roof I think still out of planks gonna be short of planks and then I want that to come the whole way down here so it's whether that's gonna be strong enough to hold it, that's going to be the next question. So, to go back in and grab some more planks, but I think we're going to have to put the wall in over there as well. So, get rid of that and that. We need that one and that one. Get rid of that as well. So I think we're going to need that there, that there, and then the normal wall there. So hopefully that'll want to hold the roof on if we can get it to go up there. That's the next thing. Get it to go. There we go. I'm thinking we're going to need to do the same here. There, and then this wall. Only because I don't know if it's going to have enough enough strength otherwise to hold itself up without it. 
knew he probably weren't going to have enough reach to get to there, so I'm going to have to knock these stairs down. Get rid of that and put the stairs back on. Turn it that way. It's not going to let us, I don't think. Ah. Stand up. Can we hit the roof now? There we go. I'm not going to be able to reach the far one, though. See if I can do the whole jump, jump and hit thing. No, it's not going to work. So we're going to need to put, obviously, this up in here as well. Into there, and one up in there as well. Just going to need to be able to reach it now, so knock this down as well. Not sure why it doesn't want to let us put it there. But... Oh, there we'll do, as long as we can reach. Both of those, can we reach that from here? I think so. It's a little bit frustrating not being able to reach things. It's not like um, Space Engineers where you can actually fly around and reach everything you want. So now hopefully... This is going to have enough strength to hold everything. There's only one way to find out, I guess. So number nine up to there as well. to get the ladder back out. Easier if it'll allow us just to put it where you want to put it. I don't think it's gonna though. It's gonna keep being a pain. What an absolute pain in the butt. We really need to do it on the outside and like climb up the roof, I think. Might make it a little bit easier. There, now we come back down. I'll leave them there for now. Which I think, I'm going to have to knock all this down. I just realised that I probably shouldn't have put that in there yet. This bit and that and that. Uh oh, that was not very far fall to die from there. I know we need some food, so hopefully it'll respawn for us. Come on, come on. Oh, there we go. Have something to eat before we go back and get our stuff. So it wasn't a very far fall at all. Grab absolutely everything. There you go, knock that down as well. Okay, it's starting to get dark already, unfortunately. So I might need to um, just pause the video here and come back when we've got enough flax stuff done. So this is what the front's going to look like. This middle part here is probably going to go up four or five stories. That's why I've had to take that down, unfortunately. And then we're going to do the same roof there, but coming across this way to join up with this building here. So 
what I'll do is I'll pause it here and um, we'll come back once hopefully I've got some more flax and we're ready to finish off this advanced mechanic stuff and I'll continue to build throughout the night and um, we'll come back and show you what it's like once we're finished so don't go anywhere we'll be back very very soon right out guys are back so I did finish that um, advanced mechanics moved on to a simple wood mills a perfect demonstration for mechanical blocks create a building in at least five blocks tall on a flat outside wall build a mechanical grist mill flat outside wall Um, okay, so we have to get up there somehow. Uh, let's go. Small stairs and wall walks. So number six. There. Oh, we're going to need a ton more planks, I think. Uh, all in a corner. We're going to need a, a ton more planks. How many we got? Well, we've still got heaps of logs, so for eight logs, and we need to make, say, 20 lots of planks after that. So, number six. For some reason, oh no, there we go. So we couldn't put it there, but we can. So as far as a grist mill goes, I have no idea what it actually does, how it works. We'll place it there, we can build it. Place a three frame vertical mine mechanical shaft, okay. Horizontal, horizontal, down, joints up, vertical mechanical shafts. One, two. I'm sure, it's going to let us go up there. We're going to have to continue this around, I think. Uh, we want to go here. Need planks. Well, come on, hurry up and finish this. It's a waiting game again. You can see how much stuff I've used to try and get this building finished. There we go. Not completely finished yet. It's going to have to go up another level. There we go. Put in. Another set of stairs. Still need more planks. Should be able to get this on top now. Still got to build them yet, so can we reach them from here? Don't think we can. Oops, should have jumped. There you go. Lock that one in as well. Come on. I don't know why it's taking so long now. There you go. Knock that one in. Oh, three framed vertical. Where are the framed vertical ones? Ah, oh, don't tell me. We need to go. Ah, oh, bugger. Should have noticed that, but we didn't. that down. It's going to look much more sturdy anyway. Number eight, there we go. Place one vertical mechanical joint down. Framed vertical mechanical joint down. Uh, framed which we need to get on top of that. So we're going to have to go up again. Which I knew we were going to have to. There we 
There we go. Put in another corner piece here. No, I'm trying to build it, not knock it down. So number nine. There. Ah, we need some more round timbers. Of course I've got no wooden logs left. But do a quick run over here and grab some. Oops, try not to get killed by the branch. Not sure how many we're gonna need, so let's just chop down a whole tree. Yeah, that's nearly done, so let's grab do a couple just in case. Hopefully we can get this finished pretty quick now. Once it hurries up and finishes, let's finish with these wall walks. Mechanical windmill unlocked. Place on mechanical windmill. Well, I'm thinking we're going to have to get rid of these first. Um, uh, horizontal, horizontal. Is that? I oh, know that's not. We don't want that. It's a joint. So we get rid of that. We want that. There, I think. Now, where's our windmill? Yeah. So we need four ropes, four cloth. Where'd our cloth go? Okay, so four cloth, four ropes. Then we need another clay jar with linseed oil. And some more round timbers, of course. Let's go up into here. I should have flaxseed in here somewhere. There we go. Make that as well. That in there, that in there. Make one of those. Uh, we need four cloth. And some more ropes. Looks like we're going to have to put in some more flax. Alright, we'll still need more. I don't know if we're going to have enough. So that's there. We've got any more flax seeds. I think that's us done with flax seeds, is it? Oh no, we've got more here. Thank God for that. We don't want to use all of them though, so we need to make three more, I think. Grab that and one of those. Okay, get rid of those and those again. There we go. Grab two of those. One more. Then that. Now, thank God we can still plant some, make some flax seeds to plant some. Actually, we had plenty of ropes anyway. What am I talking about? Let's look at the wrong number. So we required ten timbers. I've got eight. Required one. We've got six. So we need some more normal timbers. Okay, so let's run back up, all the way back up the top. Can we get this on? Ooh, I don't know if we're going to be able to. We might have to. Oh, I don't want to fall down. We're right on the edge here. I'm not sure how we're going to do this. Are we going to be able to get it over here without falling off? It's not pointing at the right thing. Ah, uh, 
right, that'll do. If we can fall onto that, that'll be great. Number nine. Now we're in the way, aren't we? There's something in the way. Oh, wow, what a pain. Ah, oh, we missed it. Ah, <laughs> oh, far out. It's turning into one of those things. It's just absolutely frustrating and the building is way too high. Let's grab a hold of these and see if we can get this to work. I don't even see what that is. Um, we need to get to there, but this is... No, we need it back further. Come on, we need you to place it where we want you to go. Of course, it's not going to work. Ah, oh, well. We need to get it all the way up there, but I don't think it's going to let us do it. One, we've got to get rid of that. Let's see if we can put that there. Now let's run back up and see if we can hopefully get down to it. Ooh, got there. Actually, we knock that down. that to there. Now can we reach? Not sure what's going on now. We're still in the way. Which we probably still are. Ah, go down to this one, see if we can get it down to there. Actually to there. Or not. Oh, wow. Well. You guys are probably face palming. You're probably just as frustrated as I am at the moment. Thank God we didn't miss that. Number nine. There. Is that right? There we go. Thank you. Craft one course of millstone tool head. Can you build grist mill? I don't even know what that even is. I think that's um. I don't think that's what we want because we want a sawmill. But anyway, craft a course mill. Uh, touching the more your mechanical system came alive. If you connected everything properly, the round axis on all the mechanical blocks are moving now. However, it does nothing useful. Coarse millstone tool head, which I don't think is in here. I think it's over here somewhere. What's that? That's a weight. Over here. No. Okay, where is the coarse millstone tool head? There. So four rocks and a round timber, which we do have. Got plenty of wheat there, so one flax left. Craft two flower sacks, which I think we may have had 
Uh, we didn't. I thought we might have had them up here. Where did... did we seriously just put that Oh, it's still in our bloody inventory. I'm looking at the wrong spot. Wow, so one of those, one of those episodes, I think. We need to craft a couple of those to make sure we don't run out. Are we supposed to do it there? We're supposed to do it over here. I don't know. <laughs> there we go. I think we're supposed to do it there. That's output. So we're supposed to put wheat in there. Oh well. That's our... Well, it's going to be our sawmill done. So I'm hoping that... Mechanical, vertical, mechanical splits. Mechanical grist mill. Um, not sure if that's. I want something. I might need to knock that wall down actually. Just want to know if I can build this. And let's quickly save it. If I knock this, oh, take that out first, and that. If I knock that out, that's not going to fall. Nope, good. So, because I want to put in a mechanical sawmill. That'll do there, I think. We need to get rid of that and that. Put that back in our hands. But we need 20 metal parts, so... There's none on the shelf. I think I did have some in here. Not enough. Let's grab some more mechanical parts. Let's grab two lots, just in case. Is it finished? There we go. Knock that down now. Need to replace that wall. Thank you. We really need to finish this off because I need to double wall. Double wall it's like looks right. Okay, so now we obviously need to make the mechanical parts to chop logs. And also Coarse millstone tool head. Smooth millstone tool head. I don't think we have it yet. Or actually it should be made over here in the smithy I think. Yeah there it is. So 40 mechanical parts and so that's 70 parts we need. So I'm going to put those in there. Get rid of that. So we need 7 of those. Well, it's going to take a while. Plank tool head for sawmill, and then you've got the timber tool head for the sawmill. I'm going to go in here. Can we make a large chest? Eight planks and four of those. So get rid of all this off our toolbar. Grab those. And grab that out as well. That can go back in and these. So I want to come over here so that way we can keep our, we've got somewhere to keep our tool heads. There. I want to open this up. We want to make timber. Timber tool head. So you can see it there. It's actually not working. Ah, I see. We've done it sort of wrong. Okay. Knock this wall down again. This episode's gone a lot longer than I'd hoped it was going to go for. Let's 
grab that out. Knock this out. Knock that floor out. Need to go mechanical sawmill. Needs to go that way. We need it to go mechanical joints down. No, um, need it to be the other way. Joints up. Like that. Knock that down. Need a round timber and a clay jar. Don't think we're going to have enough for a clay jar. Linseed jar, I should say. I think. Um, I can make one. These have got no flax seeds left, but I'll just have to go and search for it. We've got no round timbers either. Have we got any left down here? Got planks, so I'll grab them out. I have none in there. I've got heaps of mechanical parts in there. Or um, metal parts in there, I should say. Now, it's taken a little while for us to get it done. So we need one more round timber. So let's go and ah, chop down this big tree. Now oh, it's probably dark and you guys we can't see it great. Got some mushrooms too. We'll take them while we're there. Oh, okay, let's not hit that. Head in there now and smack this one in. Ah, I have to go the long way. Okay, we haven't got round timbers yet. There we go. It'll come eventually, so hopefully that's going to finish us off. Then we're going to have to finish the roof. There we go. Now the sawmill's working. That's great. Okay, so let's put in timber tool head. And all these logs. So one log gives us six timbers now. There's no real action there for it, unfortunately, but um, that's what it is. So I want to put in, obviously, some stockpiles. So we need some log stockpiles. Need to knock these out of the way. Number four. I don't want it to be through that wood if we can avoid it. Maybe one there and then one here, I guess. I'm just trying to knock it down at the same time as we're putting it in. That one needs to go in the right spot to start with. About there. Let's see if we knock that in and see how it looks. Much better. We'll do the same now for the timbers. Out there, and then out there as well. But oh, we still need more planks. Oh, that's a bit of a pain, but we still need more planks. So we got heaps of um, heaps of timber out of that. So we've finally finished our windmill. Not that um. That's completely finished yet. I'm still going to have to do a little bit off camera. Probably should have... I have to try and climb up and do all these walls as well like I wanted to. That's probably going to be one of the more difficult things. 
try and get the walls all like this. So we can obviously um, take that off, put that in. Um, put all those in now, and then they will make planks. I don't think we have like a large plank storage. We've only got, I don't even think we've got a small one to be honest. So I might have to put in like some chests or something here, but. So you can see one of these makes six. One timber makes six planks, so we're going to get plenty of planks out of it. So what I'm going to do, continue to do off camera. As we did before, continue to run these along here the whole way around the entire building, even here across like, where the door is. That one's going to be a 10 in the center, and then back to 3. Same with all the way down there. But this is going to look a little bit different to all the other buildings we're going to have around, but you'll be able to see that it looks like it's actually made out of, you know, proper timber. It's going to go all the way through here as well, well as best we can through there, and all up through there as well. But it's going to be pretty unique, and this thing is still, no, nah, it's finished. So we've got heaps of timber, or heaps of planks I should say, but we can't put timber uh, planks in there, so we're going to need another sort of storage storage area so whether we um, just put a couple of large chests in down here or a couple of those crates but I want to I want to be able to I don't know if we've got any I've got no timbers left at all I wanted to be able to block off this area so something along those lines obviously that's not going to sit right, but that's what I want to do. Block it off so we can't get in through here. You can only go in one way, but um, I'll do that off camera so you guys don't have to see it all. But um, hopefully you guys have enjoyed it. This episode has gone well over an hour now, but um, I wanted to make sure you guys were able to see everything. Knock these bloody things down there, pain in the butt. So yeah, that's what we've accomplished today. So we've done the advanced mechanics. We've finally got our sawmill in. We've just got to finish building the roof and um, putting on the final touches on and all that sort of stuff but if you enjoyed it guys as always smash that like button leave a comment let me know what you think of it so far hopefully you guys have enjoy uh, are liking it I know it's going to look like a pretty good building once it's done now um, if you haven't subscribed yet guys please do so hit that subscribe button hit the bell next to it to receive a notification every time I upload so you don't miss a thing it's been Brito's Gaming thanks for watching we'll see you again soon